San Antonio Spurs taking on the Toronto Raptors January 12th. It's a Sunday. Guys, my name is Jared. That's Joe. Philly's taking the night off. This is Sports Gambling Daily. SGD wins is where you can figure out where you can get to the private group and also take advantage of our premium plays. That's our website. All right, Joe. Toronto at home, minus three to the Spurs. <laughs> Man, this is to me. This is an interesting, interesting spot. Um, you know, with the Spurs being decent against the spread lately, and Toronto. You know, we're we're kind of monitoring the injury report. Yeah, you know, this is uh, we talked about Toronto as being a pretty much a mash unit for the past couple of weeks uh, mm-hmm. with all their players, but you know, surprisingly, they've been playing well even with all the injuries, you know, them, uh, you know, they've been surprising this year. A lot of people thought they were having a down year after uh, Kawhi Leonard, who, in fact, I saw last night, which is a beast in life. When you see these guys uh, playing not so close up, but pretty close, I mean, they yeah. just look like uh, they're just larger than life figures, and Kawhi was just a beast. So uh, that being said, Spurs, again, they've been better. I mean, six and four the last ATS, uh, you know, Popovich has got them on the, you know, here I played some defense. I like I like the Spurs to win this game. I like them to cover, and I also like uh, an under. I think Popovich will play some defense. Spur, I mean, uh, Toronto not scoring as much. Mm-hmm. So give me the Spurs and uh, give me the under. I'll take the under on this one too. Yeah, I, like I, I feel you, Joe. The only thing I'm a little worried about here is uh, Pascal Siakam. If, if He's he's been oh, yeah. upgraded to questionable. If if he if he's actually in the lineup, I kind of start to lean towards Toronto. But if that happens, that line will probably move against us. So yeah. definitely monitor the injury report and try to predict if you think that person's going to play or not. Uh, yeah. Toronto is twenty and sixteen against the spread, but San Antonio's been playing much better basketball than yeah. they had in the beginning of the year. So definitely. my pick is two sided. You know, check yeah. the injury report, but I lean San Antonio unless you know Toronto pulls out some of their or brings in some of their starters so let us know what's up guys san antonio or toronto down in the comments down below yeah guys let us know and if you guys want to see more content like this if you'd like to uh you know see jared wear a different hat but that uh shitty oiler hat he's wearing which i'm <laughs> just kidding yeah, okay, is, that, is that is that an rough honor uh, oh the rough you know what that's right it's the rough next he's, he's he's on the new uh what league now I hey, i've been that. a fan since day one <laughs> I know. Let's see how long that league. We should take an over and under how long that league's gonna last. Uh, but yeah, it, it should be. It should be pretty fun actually. What's football's are. But hey, uh, you're just upset because the Roughnecks <laughs> are gonna play the LA Wildcats the first game. Yeah. Ooh, the Wildcats! Yeah. I'm gonna fade that team. And yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be there too, baby. Let's go. <laughs> all right. Well, let's get it, guys. Then again, if you guys want to see more content, give us a thumbs up, some likes. Appreciate all the comment, and we'll see you on the next video. Golden State Warriors taking on the Memphis Grizzlies. Let's Grizzlies. get it. Yep. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Thank we'll you. be right back.